hello great people i think that the conversation must continue and the conversation is continuing now reverend ronald breku here i would not um, for, forgive my tenses and diction and all that come on we're just flowing let's flow let's flow let the conversation continue so we're looking at things which frustrate marriage and uh, we've looked at comparison in terms of finance comparison in terms of uh, we looked at uh, romance then we looked at uh, comparison t- in terms of child upbringing so romance and finance were rhyming but uh, child upbringing is not rhyming let's continue so we looked at those things which frustrate marriages and I, I think that it's good if we continue the conversation now what I want us to look at right now is appreciation 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 appreciating each other appreciating each other now uh, in marriage it's essential that in our hearts in our deeds in our speech we appreciate the other person for what they are doing the good things they are doing in the marriage they may not be perfect but i think that uh, it's it's very essential we learn to appreciate and look at the positives of um, whatever they are doing right um sometimes uh, we just we just not appreciate it because hey it's their responsibility so if they are doing it then what's the point what's the point of uh thanking them but it's good to say thank you if the food was good say thank you when you are taken for an outing say thank you when you are uh, how do you call it uh, your, your your wife uh, does something good for you in bed say thank you your husband does something wonderful for you in bed say thank you Thank you is, is, is a good word, it's a magic word, it's a wonderful word. It's a word of appreciation, ladies and gentlemen. So, thank you is good. Now, there are points where your thank you should not be asking uh, just a thank you, but sometimes you embellish it with words. You, you, you do some moments of exaggeration so that the other person will, will put a smile on the other person's face. Oh, your food is so delicious. I'm not sure a French chef can even do this good when it comes to your food. And you see there'll be a smile here and there, you know, that kind of thing. Uh, you celebrate your man who is a responsible man in marriage. I think that it's, it's, it's essential, right? Uh, it's essential for us to celebrate each other and also to... Uh, celebrate each other when we are doing appreciation and you see when we appreciate each other then there's energy and then there's a motivation to do more but sometimes if you do things and you are not appreciated then it sometimes becomes a struggle to do the next thing now in deeds too it's important that in deeds we do the appreciation if somebody buy if your wife or your husband buys you a gift and you keep it somewhere you don't wear it you don't use it and all that they feel you don't want it and it, it's not an appreciation maybe it's bad but sometimes you can even uh, wear it sometimes use it especially uh, if you can even use it uh, in certain cases you try right and you try to discuss it or you try to tell them that oh I really appreciate the kind gesture you have uh, done for me I'm very overly elated that you have uh, a, a good thought towards me but then perhaps um, what I want to do, uh, I'll prefer maybe the next time the color is not red or the color is not blue, but another color, right? That's also another way. Don't mind my movement. I think, uh, yeah, you get me. I'll prefer that. I think I think that, that that's that's a, a, a good thing to do, right? It's a good thing. So we must appreciate in our actions and in our deeds, right? To, to let the other person know that they are appreciated. I, I tell you, when they notice they are appreciate, appreciated, if they are, if they are the, uh, if they are, if they are good human beings, come on, they'll be inspired to do more. So until we meet again, my name is Reverend Ronald Mirku. We've been looking at things frustrating marriages. We've looked at um, comparison. We've looked at uh, romance and then finance, and then we looked at child upbringing. And today we're looking at the aspect of lack of appreciation. And we are we've, we've considered the need and the essence to appreciate each other. So until uh, until we meet again, uh, it's bye. All the best. Bye.